that's how I book it. It's definitely uh, Summer Slams is last. His days are it's, numbered. It's got to be, man. It, it's it's got to be. It's got to be. Anything, anything else? Money in the bank wise. I just I feel like there's no, not really. Right? I mean, they didn't. <laughs> They didn't have the uh, raw tag. Oh, match. Shinsuke Nakamura. They didn't have the Shinsuke Nakamura. AJ. No, they yeah. didn't. Shinsuke Nakamura and AJ's done. Done. Yeah. Um. What are your thoughts? Shinsuke's he's done in the main event. For now, dude. I I. I hate to say this, man. I I, I really do, and I I don't mean to bring up race at all, but. It's. Between Shinsuke losing and between Asuka losing, like a- Asuka, I get because they're going with Carmella's storyline. You know, I anticipated that, but I I seriously feel like WWE has a problem with putting the titles on Japanese superstars. Aside from NXT, which I don't think that really counts because it's not really it. I mean, that one's from Marks, your main TV product. Yeah, it's not exactly. Yeah. It's not a made for TV product. But I, I just I've got this, I got this thing, man. Like I, maybe they don't just don't have confidence that they'll be able to sell tickets or whatever. But I mean, come on, like, Oscar's one of the top female wrestlers. She, her merch is like goes out like crazy. Like I, and Nakamura is and huge. Nakamura is huge. And yeah, I mean, and even if you just did it for a couple weeks and gave the title back, I mean, that would be something. But I just feel like the WWE has no faith or confidence in su- in Japanese superstars holding their belt. It's kind of the inverse of what NJW NJPW did with their belts before Kenny Omega won the title. Yeah, they have two white Canadian champions. Yeah. So I don't know. I don't know what the reasoning is. I liked the match a lot. I didn't I really liked the match a lot. I I didn't want it to be Shinsuke losing because now that really Shinsuke has been like the ultimate guy yeah. since his debut in NXT. And now he's officially just a WWE superstar. So it's, it was good because now kind of the stigma around him's gone, but he's still a heel. Looks like he's about to start feuding with Jeff Hardy, which will be a great feud. And he's still just an asshole. So he'll be fine. I'm not worried about him. And it does make when he eventually does, I think, win a WWE title. I think it makes it much it, that much more big. So, or it makes it that much bigger. So you mean you think they're going to reward the match both of them at a major pay per view and not anything in between? Do you, do you think that that's the way that they're going to go? Well, I think the way they're going to go, I think when Shinsuke eventually wins the title, I think he'll be a face because. That's where he's ultimately just truly huge and super over. People are singing the song when he comes out and stuff like that. So I think he'll win it as a face, but not for a while. I mean, he's still got plenty of time to so go. So they're going to put the IC strap on him. Or the... the no, not the IC. US. The US strap Yeah, I think... On. I think so. I think he'll ultimately <sighs> beat Jeff Hardy. We kind of had a glimpse of Woken Jeff Hardy this yeah, week, we Brother Nero, which I thought was I thought was great. Yeah. I love that. I would have liked to have seen... Let's, well, I know we're not on SmackDown, but I, 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 this is what I would have liked to have seen with Jeff Hardy. So Shinsuke beat him last week. Or, well, what... He low-blowed him, yeah, right? Yeah, low-blowed him. No, wait. So I would have... No, he didn't beat him. Did he? Uh, I don't remember I last think week. he beat him. Either which way, Shinsuke got the yeah. one-up on him. That's sad for me not remember him, but... Either which way, Shinsuke got the one up on him. What I would have liked to see, is Shinsuke gets the one up on him, and then this week, beats up Jeff. Sneak attack. For a comment Jeff made, if Jeff said, you know what, I want to fight Shinsuke Nakamura because of what he did to me last last week, but he's too much of a coward. And Shinsuke confronts him and says, I'm sorry, I know speak English, and walks away, then Shinsuke beats the crap out of him. Gives him a record-breaking 10 Kinshasas. And then they maybe have a match. Shinsuke low blows him, sets him up for ten king shots, and he's just busted Hardy up. Then Hardy becomes woken. <laughs> he becomes brother Nero. Like you have to, 
you 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 have to take Jeff Hardy to, to that, that place. place. You got to put him so in we, that place. Are we gonna yeah. get Itchweed? No, I don't think it'll go because Itchweed's more silly. I don't think it'll go that. I don't think it'll go that route. Okay. Yet. Yet, I think they're going with a brother Nero version. Who's? Did you see his promo? Yeah, on SmackDown? I saw it. I see you. I yeah. love that. I loved it so much, and the fans pop for it. So I think that feud will be good, especially if they let it go for, you know, three, four months. I think it could be a really good feud. And I would love it if they start off this match. Because instantly, if we go into Extreme Rules. Oh, no, because it'd have to have. I was thinking something out loud. So I was thinking, what if they go into a match, Jeff Hardy versus Shinsuke for the title. And it wasn't Extreme Rules. So maybe they could do it Mm -hmm. on SmackDown. And Shinsuke finishes the match at the end with a low blow. Gets disqualified and just is like, I don't care. I don't speak English. I didn't know the rules. Hey, not my fault. I don't know English <laughs> rules. Because if he fights Jeff Hardy in the main event of SmackDown again, and it's a title match to where we think, dude, clearly this is the one Shinsuke is going to win next week. And he low blows Jeff Hardy. It gives that like, dude, Shinsuke didn't even care about the rules. He could care less if he doesn't win a title and he low blows you. That's worse than almost anything. A heel that's saying, Dude, I don't care about your rules. I just do whatever I want. I don't care if I lose. Big deal. And then the ultimate payoffs, they have a couple matches and Shinsuke. Yeah. I, I mean, I'll, I'll be invested in it. I I, I will. Um, I think that it's going to be interesting to see next week if, if Shinsuke still drops hints at AJ. Um, because, I mean, he did still acknowledge AJ this week. Um, and if he does drop another thing next week, then we can kind of assume that, like you said, that towards the end of the year, probably next year, he he may make a run for the title again. So, but we'll, we'll see, man. I, I still think that the title is going to, I don't think AJ is going to hold the title through the end of the year. I think that somehow you have to switch the title over to Daniel Bryan and the Miz 